Hello there, everyone. Welcome back. I am Bogmon. And you know what? Things are going good. Damn good. The Orion system is coming along nicely. I'm helping out my little rock friends. No, things are things are looking solid. Uh, we did win the game, technically speaking. But I'm not going to let a little thing like winning the game get in the way of me winning the game. I said I wanted to destroy the Antarans. And destroy the Antarans, I will. We should have our intergalactic space gate. There we go. That's a friendly looking sun, isn't it? Oh, they're not going to be happy about all of this. Not, not happy at all. There you are, buddies. Look, I opened up a system for you. At least for now. Until I need to be at peace with them again. Or... Or... Do I gather up my fleets now? Abandon the rocks, because I'm about to take out the Antarans. Oh, it's a tough call. It's a tough call. But in the end, I think there can only be one real option. I'm going to gather up my fleets now. Say what you will. I will have ten k ish. Welcome to GNN. Oh no! Having research? No. Not my research. No. Bah. I say but research. I also say ah oh, fifteen thousand credits. Oh, that's a good call. Do I want? I I could I could make ooh, yes yes. Change of plan. Just having that. I do want my 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 giantest of giant ships. Of the Death Moon Star. So you can build trade goods instead. There we go. Sorry, my rocky brethren, but uh, <laughs> I got a, I got an emergency plan first. Oh yeah. I mean, I took out two of their worlds, right? That means I was helping. Trade goods. Trade goods. Mm. All right, 31 turns. It's going to be less than that because one of the thing like every turn it gets the cost goes down. Pleasure Dome terraforming. There we go. 
Toxic, eh? Well, that's. Eh. That, I guess, in the core waste stuff. Even without. Yay! Not just evolving tickles. You're they're just they're just worth extra points. Ah, the Silicrate and the Rashan have signed a truce. That's good. That's very good. All right, that should keep you busy for a little while. Mm -hmm. All right, how is how is that cost here going? I think it'll. I think when I get it down to twenty-five turns, that should be enough. Somewhere around there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We want to we make guy worlds at the very least. Oh, we have we have quite the fleet already. Soon it will be the greatest of all fleets of all time. Not today, of course. But one day. So this will be where it's at 25. I'll be at 11k. Pretty close. No, next turn. Alright, well, that's fine. Okay, four, get that going. And move everybody to the interdimensional portal of doom. Yeah, yeah, you're colonizing worlds. Bah. I'm not impressed. No one here is impressed. Bam. Nope, not until you get a Death Star. Then you're impressed. We are right there. Three turns. So it won't be long now. In fact, it will be very short. And then we get to... Uh, we get to fire the Antarans at their home system. Hey, the Mechlar have finally gone back to their home world. I hope they, I hope they learned their lesson, honestly. It's all I ask. Ooh. Ooh. All right. All right, let's go with that. Uh, Have to give a specific order. Ah, uh, next turn. All right, good. My two fleets will gather. There we are. Whoop. Yes. 
So I think I have to wait till they have a full move action. So let's let's just see what happens next turn. We've we're at the portal to the other dimension. All right, let's see. Can I fight the Antarans? Not currently. What? Is it really not letting me pursue other options? Oh well, I'm sad now. I'm I'm sorry, everybody. Um, I won the game, <laughs> and apparently. That won't let me uh, fight the Antarans. <sighs> Destroy the mysterious Antarans race at their pocket dimension. Enabled after... I, I, built the, I built the colony structure. Well, damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it, Janet. Ah, well... Well, that was Master of Orion. It's a lot of fun. Uh, it it really did maintain the spirit of Master Orion 2. It, <laughs> it does have the effect of just one more turn. Which turns into another turn. Another turn. And half an hour you're like, I, I meant to stop 30 turns ago. Why didn't I stop? Silence. Always amazing. Uh, diplomacy needs a little bit of work. The uh, AI is, uh, is not... It's not good at judging what what kind of offers to make somebody. Which is annoying because they get angry every time you don't accept whatever they're offering. Even if you think it's completely unjustified. But that all said and done. Uh, oh, let's let's watch the timeline graph. Oh, alright. <laughs> so as you can see basically Basically, for the entire game, me and the uh, the Mechlar were side by side. Right? We all started off the same. We all started, nope, no, here's here's where we start to pull ahead, pull out of the out of the rest of them. Turn 100, 111 turns in. Kept going, kept going. Two hundred turns, we're, you know, the the lines had started to deviate. And right here, turn 284, that's when the Terran Conate uh, made a mistake. As you can see, and they were punished for it. Uh, from which they never recovered. N not ever. And then we have you know, Mechlar. That's when I started to go to war with them. Pretty very low. But then, then they should have pulled back. Come back up. Kitties, oh kitties, I was going to ravage you. But that'll have to wait for another game. So thank you all for watching. It's it's not. I'm we'll probably play it again later. Uh disable a few victory conditions. So that's from that, thank you all. See you later.